today uh, we're at the Kempton Sea Fire Resort and doing the parliamentary luncheon. The um, premier that came down and gave a very informative speech about what the government's plans are and what the sustainability is going to look like throughout our, our next few years. We had over 400 people come to this luncheon today, which is the largest gathering we've ever had for this luncheon. So that was a, a great achievement by this chamber team and uh, shows support that the Chamber of Commerce is certainly a force that uh, is respected in our community and business community and the government. Their willingness to be here today also shows that their respect. Um, today we're um, or reintroducing Logic Business um, to the business community. We rebranded Logic and uh, took that opportunity to uh, make the introduction officially of Logic Business um, for the business community in Cayman. This luncheon is super important to us. We love um, not only connecting with our business partners, with the chamber, just the whole community of, of businesses throughout Cayman that we serve um, and that we want to serve. Um, and it's important for us um, not only being business leaders um, in the community, but also um, showcasing what we do for um, our CSR and giving back to Cayman. I was um, here as a part of the R3 Cayman Foundation, which is part, um, you know, was originally founded through the um, Kenneth B. Dart Foundation. So here in that capacity as a director, I think it was a great um, area for me to be able to get the word out about R3, about what we've done for the community, but you know that there's so much more need in this place and, and you know our islands are so beautiful and the only way we can continue that is you know, if we all work together. So unfortunately it goes back to almost my state answer to my first question in that you know, having the government and private sectors being able to work together, just listening to each other um, and you know, seeing, obviously seeing people you haven't seen in a long time and being able to do that in one room is amazing. So Health City, we were a platinum sponsor, so we got the ability to be able to promote whatever we would like. And we thought it was important just based on the fact that if you're sick, we know eventually, if it's serious enough, you'll come to Health City. So we're promoting our executive health check in that every year or every two years, depending on if you already have, um, you know, you already know all of your different vitals and the different components of how you're doing from a health perspective then you may have to come every two years. But outside of that, every year, you should come and get that checkup because if we're able to catch something at an early stage from a disease profile, medicine is such now that you can either cure it or there's a high probability that your standard of life will be much better.